Hi, this is Capcom 1 here, back with more Azania playtesting. Probably not a whole lot needed to introduce here besides that. This is Blind to Z Doom and Ultra Violence from a Pistol Stout, and this is Map 6 of the current 11 level release. And we have some red brick, some custom red brick textures. More variants of standard Doom 2 textures. All with some plutonic theming in mind. Well, I had no idea there were Keiko demons back there. I need those extra shells. Ugh. Well, I guess I didn't get very long without the death in this one. I need to know to grab those shells right away. Or I'm gonna... And grab the chain gun. Or what I have isn't going to last me very long. Oh, well, there's a rat suit. I hope Deadwing is reasonably generous with the rat suit and take it now so I can do some. Whoa! Not holding back, are you? That wasn't even. I wasn't expecting. Didn't pick up anything that led to me is being expecting a trap, an outvile trap to appear suddenly. The key here is that I'm getting. I start with attack from both angles. I guess now that the two Keiko demons are dead, I should really just hide in the starting room and stop the attacks from one side. Like, as soon as you leave the south room, there's two sides you can be attacked from. And be careful that casually exploring the lava reveals an out vial all of a sudden. Well, I will use the barrels to my advantage against. No, don't walk in here! That's not what you would do, what I... Seems they took most of his health away with the barrels. <laughs> this is actually an this brick texture actually makes a nice red brick wall as opposed to a traditional red brick and those a red ash wall there too. Typically, this kind of brick is brown, and the ash wall is a blackish gray. Uh, it looks so much like I can get the rocket launcher, but can I? Well, first thing I'll deal with is getting rid of the Mancu bus. Uh, the Spectos! Suddenly, Deadwing likes the Spectos! Okay, so it looks like there's a center area here. Almost looks like a face on the auto map. I don't know if that's intended or not, but like these being two eyes that the the lava pulls the spider the arachnotrons are standing on. Almost look like they could be like two eyes of the face on the auto map. Well this area, southern area being the teeth. Not very many teeth. Okay, there's an arrow pointing at that switch. Not a secret, and I wouldn't exactly expect it to be one. 
like the L is a dead giveaway. That's a real plutonium texture on top of the... on top there. Another outrial. You teleported to a lower level. Take, oh, where's the chain gunner come from? I thought I had to kill the chain gunner. Okay, this pad lowers the lift. And that pad, kind of a touch plate. Raises the stairs that allow me to retreat. I'm kind of in two minds against whether you should have something as blatant as an arrow pointing there saying, Hey! Shoot that switch! And I guess I might think I could actually get to the switch otherwise, but an arrow is kind of blatant. Might be the best thing you can come up with, though. I guess the hell is saying, Hey! Pay attention to that switch, though! But in that case, if you're gonna give it away that blatantly, why even bother having a switch, though? Why not just make the rocket launcher be available? I'm so dead. Deadwing probably did it for a reason. It's not like it hurts the level. Well, or at least in my opinion, some people mind too many arrows or blatant pointers. I don't. Oh, there's a switch here. Oh, that's a secret. And I get stuck in this secret, so I guess I'll have to use the secret. Also, this pain elemental is... There's a dangerous master teleport line right there. Right here, there's a pretty dangerous master teleport line. Oh, plasma gun secret. Well, since it was a secret, I, I'll try and see how this goes without the plasma gun. Well, I can grab that super child out of a lot of... How far back do I have to go for some solid cover? Oh, you'll come towards me? I'll take that. Lost. More health than I should have, though, but I wasn't a. Uh, at first, I didn't notice the trap had an out vial in it. So, I wasn't able to avoid him having a chance to zap me. Wait, no, I don't want to be using that weapon because it's only available in the secret. Oh, pain elemental foes. Oh, except chain gunner foes. I keep trying, I keep picking the... Oops, that's gonna be, that's a death pit. Maybe there's all the rockets in this room because I really should have my rocket launcher selected. Both take help. Three chain gun nodes. Four chain gun nodes. Chain gun of town. Chain gun of one. 
Chain gun no two. Chain gun no three. Chain gun no four. I'll do any more. That's my least favorite thing to do with the rocket. Hit the lost soul that's too close to me. I have no shells left. There's plenty of rockets that I have no excuse to be saying the plasma gun is necessary here. Okay, so there's like an inner face and an outer circle, it looks like. Don't know what that... Oh, that switch raised the stairs so you can navigate the, the center area. Oh, was that the red door there? Like, they, like I saw a red pillow there, but I don't remember a door. I have not actually found, identified what needs, does this door need the red key? Let me look. Because I would like to know for my own sake where the actual red door was. Guessing it's meant to mark this door, the, yup. I might put, I mean, that's a good guiding pillow, but I might put another red marker closer to the door so people don't get confused like me and think they haven't found the red door yet. Like, I saw this red pillow, and I thought I was, a, I thought when I went to the left, I was actually headed away from the red door. Until I looped back around and realized there was nothing else nearby that could be a red doll. I don't know if I even have to throw both halves of this circle, but I will. Oh well, no, those are blue doors, so I probably do. See, that's a properly mouthed black doll. Well, I guess if I fall down in here, I only have one choice. Flip this switch. And that gives me the rocket launcher on that side. Oh, and more monsters appeared in the central house. Okay, did that lost soul come from a pain elemental or was it just a lone lost soul? I hope that that though. I could use that health. And I didn't see that Mancu bus. I'm not doing well today in terms of monsters I didn't see. In terms of not seeing monsters. Okay, and that loops back to the beginning. So I can't actually get a... I wonder if I must go in the center in order to get a blue key. I of course needed the red key to get into the center. Oh, I still have that ammo. Okay, now go in the center. Oh, well, duh! Yes, I need to go in the center to get a blue key. It's like literally a straight walk 
down the center, though. I doubt in reality it's really going to be that simple. Oh, no, it's not that simple. Get a ground out trial and a turret out trial right away. Well, at least I was right in determining that it wasn't just going to be a straight run to get the blue key and nothing, like, nothing was going to happen. Now I can walk in the turret trial. Or try to. I have to get the get closer to his level. Nope, don't want to use the plasma gun because it's only available in the secret. Why are you fighting the Arachnatron so much? I guess you can resurrect him if you kill him anyway. Except I killed you foes. Sadly, handled this reasonably. I have a health kit left. Or med kit. Stop selecting the plasma gun that's only available in the secret area. Okay, so am I really in the center in in the like a face? What's supposed to look like a face here? So I get out of the center. I enter the center from the south and leave to the north. And that was a blue door as well. Makes sense. Don't want a player entering the center from that angle. Now I go back around the loop till I find the other blue door. Which was beyond the center. How'd they leave you alive for so long? And that's the end of the level! Well, there are some monsters in the exit. He was 117 out of 122 kills and the exit sign. In fact, I haven't even seen an exit sign yet, just an elevator door. I can't determine if that's an actual exit switch yet or not. No, that is not the actual exit switch. But those are the actual exit teleporters, which I did not expect. I can also go here first. Yeah, Deadwing, I... I just grab some health that will be useful with playing continuous. I like the lava on the ceiling here with the corpses sticking from it. Um, like before though, I would recommend marking the actual exit lines with exit signs. So the player knows if, because like intuitively, when I flip that switch and I see that lift, I would think this is how I just continue in the level. I would think that these are just areas where monsters were. I just happened to try one of these side lifts. So I would put exit markers there so the player knows that. These are exits, and, well, there's two exit teleporters. I don't know why it doesn't do any harm. Anyways, wasn't on my best game in terms of how I played, but that was a fun level, and I'll 
leave the health balance up to Deadwing as usual. I like the red brick and I liked, I liked how it sort of looked like a face. And I liked how you can go in two different directions but have to get around the circle in the end. Next time we'll be here with map 7. No intermission text yet. And that, that's definitely a little, that's definitely a, looks like we're on an island here. Look forward to this level.